Elon Musk revealed insane new SpaceX Starship plans for 2024 with new mind-boggling innovations and technologies that will completely change the space industry as we know it. Musk is preparing to introduce the new Starship version 2, historical engine improvements, and maybe even a new Starship design. With that, Musk revealed specific plans for the Artemis lunar landing program in 2024, and as it seems, it will be very exciting to watch. We also have more information about the third flight test that will most certainly happen early next year, and surprisingly giant Starlink changes are coming very soon. So, let's explain how Elon Musk revealed insane new SpaceX Starship plans for 2024. So as you know, during the second test flight, approximately 150 seconds following its launch, the spacecraft underwent a stage separation, with the upper stage of the Starship igniting its six engines. It ascended to roughly 91 miles above the Earth's surface, surpassing the recognized space boundary of 62 miles, at which point communication with the vehicle was interrupted. SpaceX is currently investigating the reasons behind the explosions of both the Starship and Super Heavy, aiming to enhance the process for 2024 launches. The SpaceX Raptor engine significantly enhances the thrust capacity of the SpaceX Super Heavy Starship, providing over twice the power of the Saturn V rocket. In Walter Isaacson's biography of Elon Musk, there is a mention of the SpaceX 1337, which features groundbreaking advancements beyond the capabilities of the Raptor engine. Elon Musk and his team at SpaceX are considering radical modifications, such as eliminating the entire hot fuel gas manifold and integrating the fuel pump directly with the main chamber injector. Musk emphasized the importance of simplifying the design by stating, we are on a deletion rampage, leading to the removal of unnecessary tubes, sensors, and manifolds. Additionally, there's contemplation over removing the entire lower section of the booster. While the current SpaceX Raptor engines perform impressively, the new LEET 1337 is expected to achieve even higher chamber pressure, resulting in increased thrust. The LEET 1337 engines are designed to be simpler, lighter, and more cost-effective. It's anticipated that SpaceX could manufacture these engines at a much higher rate, potentially 10 times the current production volume in the same factory that currently produces 4,000 Raptor engines annually. The current Starship model is equipped with six engines, but Elon Musk has indicated plans to increase this number to nine for the Starship's upper stage. Future iterations of the SpaceX Starship might incorporate an additional three Raptor vacuum engines to enhance payload capacity. Under the current pricing, if each SpaceX Raptor engine costs $1 million, and considering there are nine engines in a Starship, with the cost of the Starship being twice that of its engines, the total cost for a complete Starship would be $18 million. And SpaceX is targeting an early January launch for Starship Flight 3, the third test flight of its massive Starship rocket and super heavy booster. The company is still waiting for final regulatory approval from the Federal Aviation Administration for the launch, but it is expected to receive it in the coming weeks. Starship Flight 3 will be similar to the second test flight. The rocket will lift off from SpaceX's Starbase facility in Boca Chica, Texas. SpaceX has three ships in final production, and any of these could be the next flight-ready Starship. For boosters, there are a few that could also become flight-ready. If the test flight is successful, SpaceX will be one step closer to launching a Starship on its first operational mission, which is expected to take place in 2024. Furthermore, Elon Musk has revealed SpaceX's plans to transition to Starship version 2 in 2024, featuring several improvements over the existing model. This new version is anticipated to enhance propellant storage, lower the rocket's empty weight, and improve overall reliability. The rocket's external design is expected to remain largely unchanged. One potential upgrade for Starship V2 is a nine-engine setup, combining six vacuum-optimized engines with up to three additional engines, although this configuration's final implementation in V2 remains uncertain. 2024 will be a very important year for the Artemis lunar landing program. As NASA's Artemis program aims to return astronauts to the moon, and SpaceX has been selected to develop the first commercial human lander for this purpose. This lander will transport two American astronauts to the lunar surface. SpaceX is collaborating closely with NASA and is expected to ensure that their lander design meets the required performance standards and human spaceflight criteria. The HLS Starship is based on SpaceX's Raptor engines and incorporates elements from the Falcon and Dragon vehicles. It features a spacious cabin and two airlocks for astronaut moonwalks and is intended to evolve into a fully reusable system for travel to the Moon, Mars, and other destinations. The Artemis program involves using NASA's Space Launch System rocket 
and the Orion spacecraft to transport astronauts to lunar orbit. The program also includes the development of new technologies and systems, such as precision landing technologies, new mobility capabilities, habitats, rovers, and power systems to facilitate extended exploration of the Moon. These innovations are not only aimed at lunar exploration, but are also stepping stones for future missions to Mars. Also, Elon Musk revealed that SpaceX currently conducts launches from Florida approximately every three days. However, the actual frequency is about once every 3.8 days, based on 80 launches in the last 311 days. Musk has set a goal for the company to achieve a launch every two days in 2024. Should SpaceX sustain this pace for the entire year, it would amount to around 180 launches in 2024. This figure is potentially twice the number of launches projected for 2023. As a result, SpaceX is on track to generate approximately $9 billion in revenue this year, with expectations to increase this to $15 billion in 2024.